Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to fix any EVE Online installer and launcher problems where you might have a situation where it quits and exits randomly or it crashes and for me when I was installing EVE Online whenever the launcher was starting up it was trying to download some patch data and it would just randomly quit for no reason and I, I could not find a solution and luckily I found a solution on one of the forums and I'm going to show you what you could do to fix it and hopefully this should fix any launch problems for EVE Online so as you can see right now when I've installed this on my Steam edition of the game I click on play and it's going to launch the launcher for EVE Online and if you just wait and see it's just going to randomly quit all of a sudden when it's downloading some patch data and this is a fresh install I have cleared the game and reinstalled it if you just have a look now and as you can see it's completely quit it's even disappeared from my taskbar and it's nowhere to be seen all right so to fix this first of all if you go to your C drive click on options click on folder options and click on show hidden files folders and drives apply that click ok click on the users folder go into your main user folder you should see app data in there then if you go into the local drive in the app data folder and then scroll down and look for where it says ccp open up the eve folder and then there should be a folder there which says qt web engine open that up go into default and if we go into service worker and what you need to do is just delete that folder which says cache storage and it's that easy just right click on it and delete it and as you guys can see after deleting that folder I've rerun the, the launcher again from the steam site and it's now installing as normal this should also work on the default launcher as well and as you can see it's now downloading the 2.63 gigabyte file and everything is working as normal in the past it was never able to reach this stage because it would randomly quit in the initial stages so if you have ever had any EVE Online launcher or installer problems where it's crashed for you and you've had crashes or it's quit unexpectedly then hopefully this should be able to fix that issue for you and now I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to go into the game and run it as well after the, this finishes. Alright so all the patches have finished downloading and it looks like everything has been installed properly after deleting that folder I think that has fixed my issue so I'm going to click on play now and hopefully this should allow me to go into the launcher and then finally I can go into the game. Just wait for that to load up. Alright, so let me just click on play now. And as you can see, I'm now in the game, so it says logging in, which is cool. So, so yeah, there we go. So hopefully this problem should be resolved just by deleting that folder, which I showed you earlier. So yeah, if you just delete the cache storage folder in the hidden folder, which I showed you earlier, and just rerun the installer again, and the launcher will pop up and it should start downloading all the game information for you. And hopefully this should launch the game as normal. If you guys have found this video useful, please hit that like button. Please also do subscribe to this channel to help support it, help it grow. If you do have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. If this method did work for you, please do also let us know that everything is working for you and everything is running fine now. Obviously, if you do have any problems, leave them below and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.